how to dictate and record using your iPhone 10, iPhone 7, iPhone 8, whatever iPhones you have. You can dictate and record within a few seconds. Let's say you are in a meeting or you are in an association or you are in a lecture and you want the, your lecturer is dictating, you can use your iPhone to record. Let's go straight to our PC here. This is my phone on my PC, as you can see from the example. You go to your App Store, you click on App Store, and then you still use this Microsoft Office. It is very important app in this phone. So when you, you, you open on my, you type Microsoft Office, if you don't have Microsoft Office on your iPhone, go ahead and install. I already have it, so I'm going to click on Open. Now, when I click on Open right down here, you are going to see Home. You see the plus button here, you are going to see actions so we are going to use the plus button i'll click on the plus button to click on the plus button you are going to see notes scan words excel powerpoint forms so to use this functionality to dictate we are going to click on words when you click on words you are going to see scan text you can still scan the text and it dictates so we are going to see here dictations the blank space and create from templates templates are already built uh, uh, documents that are already in our system so here on a blank space it's just a blank space let's say we are using a blank document we, we, we click on a blank document so whatever I'm going to, to to read or dictate from here is going to actually print on our note as you can see I'm going to click on this this audio button you click on the audio button understanding the main idea that is it as you can see so if I want to continue right down here I can I can if I want to click say insert a comma I can insert a comma here it is actually saying <laughs> everything I'm saying is dictating everything that I'm saying is actually dictating so this is how you use this is how you use an iPhone to record whatever you are dictating or a lecturer is dictating you can use an iPhone to actually record you can be in a lecture, you can be in a meeting room, you can be presenting anywhere. You can just use your iPhone, you record, and at the end of it, you can just copy and then you paste. Or you can share it with anybody that you want to share. So, I will stop the, 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 the show stop here. Now, if I want to go to the new line, let's say I want to make a new line. It's still recording. It's still recording. So I'm going to stop it. I'm going to stop, and then I go to, uh, I go to discard. I'm not safe. So if you want to use it, you can actually save. You can actually save it, and then you use it. So to go to the other function, which we are going to use an already created template. So I'm going to click on the plus button. It's still recording. It's still recording. It's going to. My internet is. Yes. I'm going to use the the templates which are already made uh, documents we are going to insert our futures there like this you come here again you click on the plus button and then you click on words here we are going to use this create created for uh, from templates create from templates here you click this to create from templates templates are already made documents as you can see here we have here let's say i want to add a title or i want to add anything on this already created or a heading let's say let's, let me use this document this one so if I want to use this document, as you can see here, let's say I want to add, I want to delete this, I'll click on delete, and then I want to add a heading on this document and then print it out. I'm just going to click on this plus button, the, the audio button here and say, be song 101. Actually, the, 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 it can't spell be song because be song is not an English word, but whatever I'm saying now is written on or is dictating and you can see so this is how you you can add anything that you want to add on the already created document and at the end of it you click here to stop if you want to go to a new line you click the new line here and then you you, you click again a plus button and you start dictating so we are on youtube don't be some 101 yes you see it's actually dictated although the words are not coming out clearly but it's dictating what i am saying so if you 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 can actually go ahead at the end of the dictation and then you edit you edit a lot that a lot of stuff so when you are done you can just click here you can decide to save you can save the the, 
the document or you can discard or you cancel the recording and then you restart again so this is how you dictate you you, you dictate and the iphone records whatever you are dictating or you are in a lecture or in a meeting this is what you do just follow the some functionalities and do whatever you want to do i hope you have learned something from here um, i wish that you use this uh functionalities and use this app to do most of your documents as you can see from my step-by-step -step process if you were able to convert or dictate or do anything with this app please just let me know in the comment section until then see you next time